Ahoy hoy and welcome to the channel. I'm Dr. Sumerian. My voice still hasn't recovered because I've still got a cough, but today we're going to go over the dankest memes from the dank memes from site 19 subreddit. Let's get started. The foundation. Oh, this one is by underscore shoulder underscore. The foundation deciding normalcy. SO physics, temporal anomalies, thaumaturgy, humor related studies, pataphysics. All of you get out except for you. You stay. Quantum mechanics. One thing I've noticed about the SCP Foundation, and of course I've done videos on this particular topic, is that they just kind of arbitrarily decide what is and isn't normal. There's, um, you know, they decided when the first nuclear tests happened that maybe that should be something that they suppressed, but then they decided not to. Quantum mechanics is this weird, unexplainable, almost unreplicable. That's not true. Quantum mechanics is definitely replicable uh, science, but there's a lot of strangeness to it. Some of it's hard to explain in a way that anyone can really understand, but that doesn't mean it's not real. But the other things in universe are simply very similar and they're considered anomalous instead. The SCP Foundation employee on their way home after witnessing the most effed up thing possible for the third time this week. Huh, I guess that's just a, a normal day in the life of a Foundation employee. SCP fans when the Foundation's methods result in the end of the world. Oh dear, oh dear, gorgeous. SCP fans when the GOC methods result in minor human casualties. You effing donkey. A lot of F words in the memes this time around. I'm going to have to blank them out. Just because YouTube picks up on them when they're in uh, on the screen better than it does when I, you actually say them. Uh, this is definitely, this feels like uh, the kind of meme that a GOC fanboy might create. The uh, whole... Um, <laughs> You know, oh, the Jew minor human casualties. Not to say that the SCP Foundation, does, like, that's actually the opposite. The SCP Foundation screws up a lot. And in, when they create the end of the world, no one's going, oh, man, what a great job. They're going, wow, they effed up bad. So when the GOC does the same thing, uh, you know, whatever. But of course, those stories are all told from the position and. Oh, another shoulder meme. I, I, did I say the last one? Yep, they're all shoulder, 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 shoulder. But yeah, the GOC causes, you know, end of the world sort of stuff to happen all the time, too. And they rightfully get shit for it. SCP Foundation. Haha, <laughs> finally, this memetic kill agent will surely kill the authors. Authors viewing the memetic kill agent. The thing is, is that um, the idea that the memetic kill agents have any power in the out in the overworld, for lack of a better way to put it, uh, is kind of silly. I mean, we can't create. Well, we can, but anomalies aren't real here, so we can't create things that kill us. Or more accurately, we can't create art that kills us, probably. By the way, this one, this one and I, actually all the memes so far, all shoulder memes. I think we're, yet yeah, we're finally out of shoulder memes. This one's by Bark and Helix. SCP Foundation Facts for Kids. Learn SCP Foundation Facts for Kids. No, you fucking idiot. Uh, that was a good uh, John Oliver bit. Where they had uh, Bill Nye go on and call everyone fucking idiots for not understanding how global warming works. But yeah, the the whole yeah, chill the SCP Foundation facts for kids. Ah, man, I'm I'm I got a cough drop. It's not helping much, but it's helping some. I got a cough drop. Um, yeah, the SCP Foundation uh for, is not for kids. Period. I'm sure there are ways you could adapt it to make it work with kids, but I wouldn't suggest you do so because then it's just going to attract people to the source material, which isn't for kids. Uh, this meme was by Migs de Rutt. SCP deeper lore. Deeper SCP lore. Noobs thinking it's just some scary murder monsters and the occasional wholesome good boy. I mean, so the idea that there is deeper SCP lore kind of, I don't know. I've never really considered it to have much deep lore in the SCP Foundation, but... It is like 8,000 articles, uh, 9,000 articles, something stupid like that. We're including tales here. Maybe even, hold on, it's like 12,000? Yeah, with like 12,000 things posted to the SCP wiki, it becomes kind of, you know, necessary that, of course, there's deeper lore, but there can't really be deeper lore when every article acts as its own lore, uh, or I should say its own deep lore for itself. There isn't anything special about any one article in these particular situations the next meme is by okay duty 3908 r slash scp mods trying to remove me after i pretend the scp foundation is real the foundation paid them to keep it a secret 
Um, every, when I first saw this, the only thing I could think of was that one uh, meme where it's just a, the, the kid from, uh, oh God, Meet the Thompsons, I think it was. I can't remember the name of the movie. Just standing there going, you, you guys get paid? Or you guys are getting paid? Uh, yeah. Um, no. Me after I end up in the SCP universe, I am aware of a lot of info hazards. So this is funny because I was just talking about how uh, in the overworld, those things don't do anything. But if you got, I mean, I've got them in my head. So maybe if I did descend into the, you know, the kill agent would do something. I'm trying to imagine how that would work in a in-universe sort of way. Probably would kill you. Just like this guy. This one's got by RG. Okay. Argolry99. I think I got that name right. But yeah, all that knowledge you have in your head, that's dangerous if you go into the universe where it actually means something. But anyway, that's it. Thank you very much for watching. If you enjoyed the video, hit the subscribe button and then hit the notification bell next to that so you're notified when I upload new videos. I, um, I'm i probably going to do a video on Thursday, even though I'm, I'm feeling kind of... Uh, um, <clears throat> but if you don't see one, just it's just me taking a, a little bit of a break. I'm, I'll probably post on Twitter uh, to let everyone know. And on my Discord, but yeah, uh, I might I might take an extra day off because I'm starting to ugh. Anyway, uh, if but if you enjoyed this, hit the subscribe button, hit the notification bell next to that, so you're notified when I upload new videos. And then head on over to patreoncom forward slash d Samarium and pledge at any level, like everybody here on the screen already has, including Sinjariki, who has pledged at hundred dollars, and MC Cashmill has pledged at fifty dollars. It is nice to know that I'm not alone out here. And I will see you all again on hopefully Thursday.